Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Scorpio for the month of February 2022. It is a general reading. That being said, it may or may not resonate with you. If it doesn't sound like it's your story, check your other placements. Your messages could be there. Also, although I am reading for February, you could be feeling these energies whenever you view this video. Okay, so... Um, <clears throat> There was a past situation, and, and somebody's reflecting on that. Somebody withdrew, possibly um, in pain, but it's like they're hiding their pain, or they're they're going through. Um, <clears throat> yeah, they're going through, uh, or have been going through a period, uh, a difficult period, a period of pain. Um looking back at memories with the milk card here, longing for someone from the past or longing uh, for answers, I feel. Um, I feel like um, this could be about, uh, maybe it's about giving answers, you know? I mean, this could be about um, seeking somebody's forgiveness. Crying over spilt milk. Going through a difficult, prolonged period of pain is what these cards speak about. And with the wall, they, they may have done something, threw up a wall, and uh, sat in here for a while. Um, I feel like there's regret. They close the door. But I feel like they are preparing to open it and to let the wall down. Or this is what they're thinking of. They, they're thinking of the past. They can't, they can't get the past off their mind. The glove. I mean, it could be that they threw down the glove and retreated behind the wall in pain. Um, and maybe it finished there. Maybe nothing happened. Maybe nobody picked up the glove. It could be that somebody... Uh, went too far. It could be that somebody made, maybe this was a strategic move. Yeah, because I have the card of mind games beneath. Somebody, uh, somebody decided to walk away, but it was, it was a, a move or a strategic move. There was a cover-up, I feel. Now, they could be thinking, it, it probably didn't work, you see, and they are in pre preparing now to come out, maybe to ask for forgiveness, possibly. There's a renewed interest that is shown in somebody from the past. The Seven of Cups here speaks to um, it speaks to choices that um, could be difficult. It is about making the right choice. It could be, you know, oh, uh, what's true, what's false, what's really in these cups. It could also be um, it could also be somebody trying to uh, or now taking a more realistic view of something. And it also speaks to 
new options becoming available in the future. So, somebody shedding the light on the past, gaining the wisdom from the past for a future event. This is what this tells me. There's a challenge here um, with the strength and the fool, so I feel like um, somebody's gathering their strength uh, to take this risk, this leap of faith. It's what they're preparing to do. There was there was a meeting in the in the past, but somebody got upset. They got angry. Now um, they got upset. They got angry, and I feel like they left or felt it was too risky and left or <clears throat> got upset, got angry, and threw the glove down and left. They could have felt like it was out of reach for them for some reason, or uh, this is them being tempted to go back. Yeah, you know, because that's what they're thinking of. There's a temptation to go another cycle or go another round to start something up again uh, with this person from your past because value you value this person or you value that that relationship or you feel a sense of home and belonging there with that person or that person feels like uh, the right fit It feels like this person's been behind this wall for some time. It feels like there's been delays on this decision. Oops, I'm so sorry. I just hit the mic. <laughs> I'm so sorry. That would have been noisy. I didn't hear nothing, but you guys would have heard. Anyway, um, two of swords in the reverse. <laughs> Look at it. Look at this card in the upright. They really, really want to, they're so tempted. They really, really want this person or want to go back to this person. But, you know, they're really fighting it. It's why there's these delays. It's why it's in the reverse. They're fighting it. Hiding. Yeah, it looks like um, somebody, this is talks about heartbreak, broken heart, possible third parties even, um, feeling insecure. But this person, I feel like what they're hiding from you is that they're head over heels in love with you. It's possible there's some worries about a, a third party for someone. And if so, well, this person has a really uh, jealous streak in them. That would have made them angry enough back here to, to just shut you out and go behind that wall. You or them, like, you know, these energies do go vice versa. Um... So there's there's um, some very important news coming that's going to change this energy. We see it here and we see it over here. The same card from different decks, that's all. Now, let's speak about this one. Um, here we have with it the Nine of Cups the Three of Swords in reverse, but this one in reverse is actually the Three of Swords upright in the traditional tarot. 
because here it has they haven't hit and here they've hit so this is somebody's heartbreak now what does the nine of uh, nine of cups say about that card well it says that if you've been experiencing any sorrow or pain then this card says that these uh, this hard time or these bad times are soon to be behind you and a period of happiness and fulfillment is coming and you will get news to that effect here with this card now I want you to look at the archer's face here I don't know if you can see it it is very very serious now that's very important on this card because what it says is that there is very serious uh, messages coming in and you need to respond when you get it because this person will be kind of like waiting on uh, how do you say uh, they're waiting on your response but they're they're like sitting on pins and needles so they're like impatient impatiently waiting for your response and I feel like what I get from this is that this person is typically like this like 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 they are you know it's I want it and I want it now <laughs> so I'm sending this this message out and I want your response now <laughs> that's what it tells me so we see this coming the um, the arrow is in the bow it's getting ready to be sent and they are very concentrated on that message I feel like this person has thought for uh, some time that it was out of reach or you thought it was out of reach because of this person being behind the wall and not showing themselves not communicating whichever way this goes this message or news it just changes everything this is and we see it here again see if if somebody was unwilling to listen and compromise in the past that's all changing with this this is yeah look unexpected news coming okay to bring this to this news brings it these people have arrived at the other shore they've arrived there okay it's what you've been wishing for look the nine of cups is here again repeat it comes in unexpectedly they're coming in to close the distance someone from the past you are about to be reunited with this person this is somebody you are destined to connect with the news the messages bring an outpouring of love this person after all of this time is now willing to listen to compromise um, they are asking for your forgiveness and they are ready to place their heart in your hand the arrow hitting the bullseye speaks to hope that it's going to work this time and I feel that it can work but the swords that you've brought with you they need to go 
they need to go. Do not carry them with you on this journey um, from here. I thank you for watching, for liking, and for sharing my videos, and for subscribing. Also, thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation. It is greatly appreciated. Many blessings to all of you.